Hello, this is Dr. Anshul Pant and today I'll be telling you everything you need to know about adolescent or teenage acne. Acne is a very common disorder amongst teenagers. About 80% of adolescents and young adults suffer from acne and this can sometimes continue into adult years, especially in women. So what causes acne? There are mainly four processes which are involved in the formation of acne. First and foremost is increased oil secretion. Second is thickening of the lining of the epithelium known as hyperconification. Third is bacterial infection and fourth is a reaction of the skin to all these processes known as inflammation. So what are the factors which predispose you to develop acne? First and foremost is genetics. If your parents have had acne, there are high chances that even you will suffer. Hormonal changes also predispose us to develop acne. That's why we see a lot of acne form eruptions during puberty. Applying thick oily products on the face, excessively oiling your hair can also lead to acne. It has been suggested by certain studies that even stress plays a role in acne formation. That's why we see a lot of eruptions during exam times. Both females and males are affected by acne, but females are affected more, are more bothered by the condition and are more likely to seek help. It is important to seek help for your acne in order to prevent the sequelae of acne. I have a whole video on that which I'll be linking in the description below. Early treatment will help in reducing the psychological burden of the disease and also prevent the consequences of acne such as scar. The choice of treatment for acne depends upon the type of acne and its severity. There are many topical and oral medications which are very effective in controlling acne. Topical medications include antibacterial creams, creams to reduce oil production, azelic acid, benzoyl peroxide and cleansers. Oral medications include antibiotics and retinoids and there are certain studies which have shown that zinc supplement can help in improving acne. The choice of medications and the duration of treatment depends upon your severity. And please do not pop your acne. As tempting as it may be, please do not touch or try to pop or burst your acne. I have made a complete video on the consequences of popping your acne which I'll be linking in the info card. You must remember that acne is a chronic disease. It takes at least 3 to 6 months for you to see good improvement and to maintain it. Do not expect your acne to instantly vanish as the results take time to show and you have to be regular and adhere to the treatment. There are certain lifestyle changes you need to make and certain skin routine regime that you need to follow regularly if you want clear skin and acne free skin. Following a proper skincare routine as instructed by your dermatologist will help you in getting that clear acne free skin. If you found this video useful, kindly share the video and also subscribe to the channel.